Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this very, very powerful and exciting video of algebraic challenging equations, here we are going to solve one very interesting problem from functional equations, not for the value of fx, but for the period of fx. We have to find out the period of function fx. What does it mean if period of function fx is written? So I can write f of x plus t equal to f of x. Then this t is called period of function fx. You can consider this thing by one very easy example. If you will consider fx is equal to one periodic trigonometric function sin x, then you know the graph of sin x is like this and after every 2 pi interval it is going to repeat itself. It is going to repeat itself. So, 2 pi is called the period of the periodic function sin x. That is why we used to write sin x plus 2 pi is equal to sin x. Because of this, I can write f of x plus t equal to f of x. Okay. Now, let us consider our original equation as equation number 1. My target is to frame our functional equation in this functional form. Once it will be done, I will write this t is period. Okay. I will cross multiply the written terms. So I will write f of x plus 2 minus f of x plus 2 times fx equal to 1 plus fx. So I will write fx in terms of x plus 2. Collect all the terms which are having fx to the right. I will write f of x plus 2 minus 1 is equal to f of x in bracket. I can write f of x plus 2 plus 1. Okay. Now from this equation I can write fx would be f of x plus 2 minus 1 divided by f of x plus 2 plus 1. Let me call this is my equation number 2. Now I will give one substitution. In equation 1, in equation 1, I will replace x with x minus 2. Okay, let's do it. So here I will put x in place of x, I will write x minus 2. So let us do it. x minus 2 plus 2, right hand side also. I will write 1 plus f of x minus 2. Then denominator I will write 1 minus f of x minus 2. Now I can cancel this plus and minus 2. What would be left? f of x is equal to 1 plus f of x minus 2 over 1 minus f of x minus 2. Now you can see, let me call this is my equation number 3. Now you can see equation 2, we are having fx. Equation 3, we are having fx. Okay. So we can equate both the equations because both refers to the same function fx. Let me equate. I will write 1 plus f of x minus 2 over 1 minus f of x minus 2 equal to f of x plus 2 minus 1 over f of x plus 2 plus 1. After equating both equation 2 and 3, we will have this form. Now I will cross multiply so that I can find out fx plus 2 and fx minus 2 relationship. Let's do it. Cross multiply. So I will write 1 plus f of x minus 2 times f of x plus 2 plus 1 equal to f of x plus 2 minus 1 
in one bracket and in second bracket the denominator of LHS that is 1 minus f of x minus 2. Now let's multiply. I will write f of x plus 2 plus 1. Done. Now with this term I will write f of x minus 2, f of x plus 2, then I will write f of x minus 2. LHS is done. Now RHS. f of x plus 2 minus f of x plus 2 times f of x minus 2, then minus 1, then plus f of x minus 2. Now the term which we can cancel, we will cancel. As we can see, f of x minus 2 plus 2, both values we will cancel. Now what is left? Term with f of x plus 2, f of x minus 2 and another term is constant. So let me consider all the functional equation to the left. So I can write 2 times f of x minus 2, f of x plus 2, equal to minus 1, minus 1, minus 2. So I can write here f of x plus 2 times f of x minus 2 equal to negative 1. Okay, from here I can write f of x plus 2 equal to minus 1 over f of x minus 2. This is our functional equation where x plus 2 and x minus 2 have mutual relationship. Now I will give only two substitution to find out our final answer. First one is I will replace x with x plus 2. So if I will do that, see my target is denominator. Once I will put x in place of x, x plus 2, then I will get denominator fx. So I will write x plus 2 plus 2. Done equal to minus 1 over f of x plus 2 minus 2. So this term we will cancel. So conclusion is f of 4, x plus 4 equal to minus 1 over fx. Okay. Let me write here. f of x plus 4 is equal to minus 1 over fx. This is our next previous equation and the earlier one was f of, let me write here, f of x plus 2 equal to minus 1 over f of x minus 2. Done. Now second substitution or replacement, I will write x, I will replace with x plus 6. So here I will put, let me put over there, so I will write x plus 6 plus 2, done. Now come to RHS, minus 1 over f plus, in place of x, x plus 6 minus 2. So ultimately I am having x plus 8 equal to minus 1 over x plus 4. And we have calculated f of x plus 4 that was equal to minus 1 over fx. So let me write over there minus 1 over fx. So it is nothing but fx. See. So conclusion is f of x plus 8 equal to f of x. So by the fundamental or for from the basics of period, we can conclude this is our t. x plus t equal to f of x. So period is equal to 8. This is our answer. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck.